QAnon fire suspect arrested after 10 months, Anime Studio has nothing to say to 42-year-old man detained in Osaka. Police arrested a suspect in QAnon Studio One building fire incident under suspicion of arson and murder at a hospital in Kyoto just after 7 a.m. on Wednesday. Authorities then transfer him to Fushimi Police Station for questioning after 8 a.m. The 42-year-old unemployed man from Minoma, Saitama, reportedly admitted to the charges and said, I thought he'd be able to kill many people if I used gasoline. QAnon News issued a statement on the arrest on Wednesday morning. The studio had nothing to say to the man and added that actions and the results are everything. The studio explained, no matter what excuse the suspect could give for his actions, no matter what kind of words or remorse for the results, he could state, there is no bringing back our colleges whose leaves were snatched away and no healing for our injury, injured colleges. The statement continued by saying that the families and friends of the victims must face an irreversible reality and are doing the same. QAnon believes that the police will pursue the criminal liability of the suspect to the maximum extent in accordance with the law. After consulting with several doctors, police had decided to wait until the man had sufficiently recovered from his injuries to be able to participate in an investigation before arresting him. Police also considered the lifting of Japan's nationwide state of emergency this week in relation to the arrest. A court approved detention of the suspect in the afternoon on Wednesday, and authorities transferred him to Osaka Detention Center, which has doctors permanently on, on staff. Police plan to consider the suspect's physical condition as they continue their investigation with him housed at the detention center. According to previous police reports, the suspect had allegedly the QAnon stole his novel. The studio CEO Hideaki Hata stated last July they had never heard the suspect's name before, and no one by the suspect's name had submitted a novel to the company. QAnon solicits drafts of novels as part of his QAnon Awards program.